You want to know exactly how I'm feeling? Yes, sir. I just stood here in this Los Angeles County and witnessed the worst miscarriage of justice yes. that this world has yes. ever seen. Yes. You want to know how I feel? Yes. I'll tell you exactly how I feel. I got some names that I want to call. Alex Spiro, Desiree Perez, and the whole wicked system of Rock Nation, yep. including you, Jay-Z. Yes. Yes. You who yes. say yes. you rose from the gutter, but you have traded and bartered the souls of young men, yep. and you're still doing it. Amen. The only independent witness in this courtroom is a man whose name is Sean Kelly. He came to court, and our attorneys, he would not even shake their hand after he went upstairs with Kathy Ta and Alex Bart. They met on Saturday before. They met, they on Saturday. met with our Saturday witness. Night. And then the man came back, and remember. I sat in the hallway while he sat with Jody Little, the prosecutor's investigator, who acted so dumb, an intelligent woman who did not want, listen, I've seen so much evidence buried in this, yeah. and I know exactly what the public out oh, here will yeah, say. Yeah. Don't talk. You will say, I say this because I'm a father. See, I am a father of thousands around the world. I'm a father of my kids, but a spiritual father to many. And I don't make stupid allegations because I got nothing better to do. You all have been bartering and trading the souls of young black and brown men yes. in this country. And I'm calling on all the umbrellas. I'm calling on everybody in this country to begin to rise up That's because right. your sons yes. have been done right. dirty. It's Bryce Davis on the check-in. And for y'all that don't know, Tory Lanez was found guilty of shooting the Meg the Stallion. You know, definitely didn't see this coming, especially with, you know, the things that were circulating online, you know, like on the DJ Academics page and whatnot, you know, one plus one was equaling three, things wasn't adding up. So we thought Tory was gonna walk away free. You know, like I said in the last video, you know, I was just sit back and wait to see what they say before we pass judgment. and. You know what they say, there's three sides to the story. You know, you got his side, her side, and the truth. So, you know, but you know, like they said, he was found guilty. So if he really did, you know, shoot Meg the Stallion, then, you know, obviously he deserves all the time that he gets. But, you know, uh, it sounds like his dad is just, you know, in an emotional state right now, which is extremely reasonable. But at this point, he's just letting the clip off of anybody talking about uh, Jay-Z and Rock Nation, like what they got to do with what, happened that night like literally like they had nothing to do with that so you know sometimes uh we gotta sit back and analyze ourselves um to our best not to give out too much of an emotional response because that's when we tend to be the most irrational you know but it's definitely understandable if you feel like you know your son was innocent and you know he's about to be locked away so much potential one thing i don't understand is all the hate like uh at the end of the day, man, this is somebody's dad, brother, son, another black man lost to the system. And I'm not even that racy type dude, but it's like, come on, man. How can we really be happy that, you know, a talented artist, you know, like Tory's going to be gone the rest of his life in a cell? Like, you know, that, that it's just not something to celebrate to me. Like, yeah, trust me, he's going to pay for doing what he did. Like, that's no question. If he got to do five years, 10 years, whatever, but, this, you know, to banish him forever because you know everybody got intoxicated and he made a mistake i don't know about that one you know what i'm saying i'm not religious so you know i'm not gonna say only god can judge me but uh hey you know what do i know but anyway if you like the video make sure you like and subscribe